So I just decided I'm going to a wedding next week with over 700 people in Atlanta, Georgia, and I've never met any of them. This is how it happened. So as many of you know, I was a real estate agent for a number of years. I now work on another side of real estate, but I met a lot of cool people being a real estate agent. And one of the perks is like when people move out of an apartment and you okay with them, they'll leave behind all types of stuff like forks or a pair of jeans, whatever. And I moved into this apartment when I was 21. So I'd always like find random things and I'd furnish my apartment. Okay, so back in 2016, group moves out. Nothing's in there except for one thing, this. Just a baby photo. And I added that, but just this. So I'm like, fuck it, I put it on my wall. And anytime someone would come to my apartment, I'd make up some like ridiculous story. Like, oh, that's Derek Jeter, or that's my older brother who passed away. Just like something ridiculous and get the recording on camera. And I was a little more hinged back there on Instagram, so I put it on my Instagram story. I got like a little bit of a following. And eventually one day I got a message request. This was years ago. And it was one of the guys I rented an apartment to. I forgot that we connected on social. And he's like, hey, my friend Bennett uh, is wondering why you have his baby picture in your apartment. And I had never met the guy. And Bennett gets in touch with me. And I'm, I'm being a shithead, right? He's like, hey, can I have that back, blah, blah, blah. I'm like, nah, this is mine. So we started texting. And anytime someone would walk into my apartment, I would send him the video of the new story that I was telling them about his baby photo. So he would know like it was in like good hands. So I've been doing this gag for like five, six years. And it was being in New York. He's like, hey, can I stop by at this time? Can I grab it? I'm like, no, no, I won't be here. And COVID happened. So we've been going back trying to exchange his baby photo for like seven years, but I'm not really playing ball. And then I get this. You can pause the video if you want to read it. I'll also provide an explanation. So that's his fiance, who's like, hey, we're getting married. And she goes on to say like, this is gonna be the wedding gift. This is gonna be the only gift I'm giving him for his wedding. And I'd love it back. And I'm, I'm a man of my own character. I'm like, no, no, this is mine. But if I get a wedding invite, plus a plus one, I will come to your wedding and present this as the gift to your new husband in front of 700 people. So this is their wedding going next week. I think the websites, they even have a website, juliaandbennett.com in Lake Okanoe, Georgia. Off part two.